Welcome everyone, Stephanie Lee, Evidential Medium here on my spiritual journey with my monthly book reviews. Books that have led me down the path of spirituality and mediumship. In this month, for April, we are doing Excuses Be Gone by Dr. Wayne Dyer. Wonderful, wonderful man. Um, we have gone through um, his six steps in the previous weeks and we are going to finish up with the seventh step to Excuses Be Gone. So I'm gonna review each of the steps and kind of go into them again. Um, <clears throat> so just, for, just, just to give you a little sneak peek, the seventh step is how do I continually reinforce this new way of being? How do, I, how do I keep going on this trajectory of ridding myself of these excuses and these beliefs that are no longer serving me? Um, so Dr. Wayne Dyer says, with constant practice, you have to constantly practice it every day. You have to run through those six steps every single day. And as you keep doing it, it'll just become more of a habit to you, right? So an excuse comes in and you say, oh, okay, the first step is, um, is it true? Do I know that it's 100% true, right? So you say that, is it true? Yes, no, I don't know, probably no. Um, where did the excuse come from? I allowed these excuses, right? I allowed these excuses to run my life and keep me stuck in this little safety zone, right? Um, what's the payoff um, if I continue to use these excuses, guess what I get? I get to avoid taking any kind of risk and I get to just stay in the same old spot. Just being me, do, 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 right? Um, number four, what would my life be like if I could no longer use this excuse? I would be free to do whatever I wanted because I have no excuse to hold me back, right? There's nothing holding me back. I get to go forward. I get to keep walking down that road. I'm not stuck in my little position, right? Fifth step is, can I create a rational reason to change this? And that's easy, you, you have a choice. You can say, yes, I'm going to do this because it's more aligned with who I am. And then the sixth one is, can I access universal cooperation in shedding old habits? Yes, you can. You can reach out to whoever your higher power is that you believe in and ask for help. That, that They're always there to help, whoever that is for you. Um, and then you just have to constantly and continually reinforce this in your brain over and over and over again. Always keep in mind, that no single person, place, or thing can force you to believe or disbelieve in, any, in anything. Those are choices, those are up to you. Those are all your beliefs, they're your choices. So you get to make the choice if you want to believe in them or no longer believe in them. And then if you're no longer gonna believe in them and go on this journey of possibility of what your life could be like, how refreshing is that? How exciting is that? Um, in conclusion, if you're going to take on this task, my suggestion would be to do it for like a week. Just say, okay, um, just take little excuses, like little things you've been putting off or something, right? Um, and just take one thing and work on it that week. So I would journal it, I would write it down at the beginning of the week, here's my excuse, blah, 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 blah. I'd go through the seven steps. And as you kept referring back to that excuse during the week and referring to the seven steps, see where you are at the end of the week. Have you gotten through maybe three of the steps where you're, you know, you're kind of like, I'm on the fence, I'm almost ready to just let go of this bad boy. And then see how it goes. And if it takes you maybe two weeks, or maybe it only takes you one week and then the second week you want to start in a whole nother excuse. Do whatever works for you, whatever makes you happy and makes you continue to go forward because that's what I want for you. I want you to be ever knowledgeable of how to make things work better for you. Don't do what I say. Don't do what Dr. Wayne Dyer says, but if it feels good to you and it works for you, go do that. 
So I wish you well. We're going to have another book in May. Still not sure what it, I, I have an idea. Just kind of like I had an idea for this one, but sometimes, you know, I change my ways. Um, if you have any questions or you want to reach out to me, um, or you want to set up an appointment for a reading, just go to stephanieleemedium.com. Thanks and have a great rest of your week. Bye.